Hello everybody. Welcome to Green One Day at a Time. Today I will be ha- showing you what all I have been harvesting in the month of March and also planting some Jerusalem artichoke along with some radishes. Jerusalem artichokes are root vegetables which stay in the ground for our UK winter weather. This is a comb or a tuber. So that's where it is connected. It was connected to the plant. and that's the growing tip so you can see that's where it will start to produce a new plant so all these can be planted in the ground as soon as you receive so that's another growing tip another one and these are all really good sized tubers so we have prepared the bed with some well rotted manure and spent compost and i'm going to plant them around 45 to 50 cm apart and 15 cm deep i will also broadcast some of the radishes that i showed before this is a trial to see if i can harvest the radishes before the artichokes come up next let's have a look at what i'm harvesting at this time of the year in march so these are some of the carrots a uh, third sowing of carrots from last year i left them in the ground to overwinter them and now i'm going to harvest them they are not long carrots they are the short round ones the month of march and april is usually known as the hungry gap when we do not have a lot of harvest from our veg patches so planning ahead for an overwintering carrots or artichokes which can stay in the ground and leave them when you need to ear to consume them or even planting brussels sprouts purple sprouting broccoli so planning ahead and planting these ahead will allow you to harvest many vegetables during the hungry gap Next I will be harvesting my first parsnip. I've never grown parsnips before. Last year was the first time I did it. There was a slight problem in in oh that's broken. That's broken. Some of it is left in the ground. There was a si- slight problem of me weeding out more parsnip seedlings than what was actually needed. So I have got very few parsnip parsnips in the ground now. the ground is very hard so it's quite difficult to pull it out so i have to dig a little bit be deeper that's big enough that's quite a good sized one i'm happy with that size these are the carrots and the parsnips another thing that you can plant to get a, a harvest at this time of the year a swiss chard these are white stemmed swiss chard and i got a good harvest this year I hope you enjoyed this video. Stay safe and see you soon with another one.